Hi friends, did you know that you can create playing test submission Google Forms? This blew my mind and I just had to share it. Go ahead and click on the plus sign from Google Drive and you're gonna wanna pull up a blank form. First things first, let's put a title on it. Playing test submission form. Please submit your playing test here. Now, with the title, if you have it listed here, it will automatically populate. Let's go to the first question. It should always be, type your first and last name here. Great, and require it. Always make sure you did this. Click plus. This one, we are going to change to a file upload, and you're gonna click continue. Tell them what you wanna play. Mary had a little lamb playing test. You should allow video and audio files. One is fine. 10 megs is probably not enough. One gig should be plenty for what you're gonna be doing. Um, and then I highly recommend you notice the form can only accept up to one gigs um, to start with. Let's change that, click change. And the first thing you're gonna do is just let's go big or go home. Most school districts don't limit how much data you can have. I mean, you may have to delete them over time, but for starters on a playing test submission, this will make it so no matter what, you're gonna get all of your files. Um, do not let them edit after submission. Otherwise, if you say it's due by Thursday, they might change it after they upload it, and that's not okay. Um, I would recommend limiting it, limiting it to one response. Otherwise, you might get kids retaking it 18 times, and nobody wants that. Not right to start with. And I also recommend, I think it's always a good idea just to throw an email response on there. You may want to give a, re, uh, a, a response or not. That's up to you. But I like to have their email addresses on there. You may want to kind of fiddle through these other settings as well, but most of the good stuff is right here. Always click Save with that. So. Just to review, we put a title on it, told them what to do, first and last name, check that it's required, click here again, tell them what to play, make sure that this is a file upload, allow video and audio recordings, one file, one gig, change, go big or go home, limit the response, and then collect email addresses, save. This is it. If you wanna see what the kids will see, click preview. This is what they'll see. Maybe you can check your work. And if you wanna see what you're going to see, you're going to click here, create, create sped, spreadsheet. If you see nothing here, it's because you didn't title it. And that's all you need to do is put a title up here. So go ahead and click that, click create. And that will open up the spreadsheet where all of the information, you get a timestamp, you get an email address, their first and last name, and the files will be listed here with a Google Drive link. Super easy. Let's work smarter, not harder. Good luck, friends.